Hi everybody, Jay Billis of ESPN. This week on Duke's Blue Planet, we're gonna take you behind the scenes of ESPN's college game day. And whenever we're on site for a big game like we are for Virginia at Duke, uh, we have a really big operation. We have a big crew that comes in uh, to put on our college game day show and all the stuff we do around the game, whether our sports center hits, the promotion that we do, uh, it's a lot that goes on behind the scenes, but we have so many people behind the scenes that are absolute superstars in their jobs. And you'd be amazed at what they do, whether it's in the truck, audio, uh, all, all the stuff that, that happens that puts on game day. Uh, we probably have about 50 people that go site to site, uh, and, and most of them work on college game day football and college game day basketball. So they're on the road all year long away from their families and do, uh, do an amazing job. And we're lucky to work with them. So we're happy to have you behind the scenes for this all access. I think anytime I watch a team practice, I'm trying to get a feel for not only what their game plan is, uh, but uh, what they're teaching and the things they're emphasizing. Uh, not necessarily with this one opponent, although that's important, but just overall. Interesting part for me is I learned the game a certain way. I played for Coach K, I learned it a certain way, and I think that's a, a, an amazing way. But it's not the only way. There are uh, great coaches out there that do things differently. So I've learned a ton about, about the game and I've seen it done differently. And it's really opened my eyes to all different ways to play and play successfully. There's not just one way to play this game. That's been, that's been really enlightening for me over the years and really interesting. This is our meeting room where we have our show meetings and all of our show prep and I'm here with our uh, amazing crew. So over at the end is Jay Williams, the highly caffeinated, the highly caffeinated Jersey retired uh, player here at Duke, number 22. Seth Greenberg, the great coach from Virginia Tech. And then our host, Reese Davis. We sit around drinking coffee and we tell stories about how great we used to be, especially Jay Williams, frankly. <laughs> You know, yeah, same way coach study film. We just study film on three and sixty division one team. We'll see you at game day, eleven o'clock. But you'll see this way after it's over, so I don't know why I just invited you. What's up everybody? It's Mike here, checking in from College Game Day. We got all the crazies here, got all the fans here. Got some great posters, great atmosphere here. So we're really enjoying it, really excited for the game today. Duke, Virginia. Hey, the big question is how is Duke gonna handle playing without Trey Jones? Someone needs to step up. I think Duke's gotta find a way to play ahead of the defense. Duke's gotta find a way to speed up this Virginia team and run them off the three-point line. This is going to be a classic. This is our broadcast position up in the Crow's Nest here at Cameron Indoor Stadium. And this entire Crow's Nest has been redone the last year, totally reconstructed. Uh, it's a lot more comfortable and it gives you a, a unique view, but it's a little bit of a different view. So right before a game, all we're really trying to do is get in our last minute preparation as the game in front of us is Auburn and Kentucky. If that game goes a little bit long, which can happen with free throws at the end of the game, it changes the way we come on the air. So we have to be prepared for every type of eventuality. But what we're really looking forward to is uh, Virginia and Duke uh, in what's always a great ACC game. Gonna have to fire soon. Three and two, step back three, count it! Bounds on the right sideline. Behind the back with a dribble. Another crossover. Got by Key. Gets inside. Forced it up. Counted. And a chance for three. Shot blocker was coming. And then hesitated. Messed it up. He was on! Jack White. White gets inside. Oh! 
15 to shoot. Still hasn't moved. Just staring down Kyle Guy. Gets inside. All the way to the hoop. He's bumped. Count it! And a chance for three! Big time free throws for Marquise Bolden. And Duke knocks off the Cavaliers 72 to 70. Electric game, right Electric there. game. This is Brennan and Mike. Right here. What a win. Shout out to all of our guys. Yes, sir. We needed that. What's up, Duke Blue Planet? I try here with RJ and Zion after a big win in Cameron. Um, big win over Virginia. Uh, you know, RJ, you had 30 tonight. Um, you took over point guard for us, got, got everyone settled, but then um, when it was time to uh, make winning plays, you were able to do that. What was going through your head? I told you I got you, bro. I told you I got you. But nah, I mean, Zion was unstoppable all game. and. Definitely at the end, that opened it up for me because they were worried about him. So, you know, just a great team win. You know, you were an unstoppable all game. What was opening up for you? Honestly, Trey, I, I don't know. My teammates were just saying, get the ball and go. So, whenever, whenever I got the ball, I just went, man. Just, <laughs> and it was just open? Yeah, or, yeah it was just open, yeah, it was man. just open. <laughs> what were we able to do to overcome the, the poor shooting from the outside? We were just able to play with heart, courage, you know, the brotherhood. Three times. Yeah, three times, seriously. What do, you, what do you have to say to the fans out there? You know, it was the best crowd of the year. What do you have to say for the fans out there? I love you guys. Thanks for coming out there. I truly do. Keep that same energy all year long. <laughs> Crazies are lit. I love y'all. <laughs> Duke Blue Planet, we'll see you Tuesday. Yeah, man. What's up, everybody? You know, just another travel day. About to head down the pit for another game. Um, we're excited, and let's go get this dub. What's up, dude? We plan it. It's Jack. Um, just arrived at our pre-game meal. Just hopped off the elevator. Um, we have a nice team meal here at the U Club. Um, big game against Pittsburgh tomorrow, so we're trying to get prepared. We got Sam. Say what's up, Sam. Hey! Sam takes care of us. Always get great food. Yeah. Got a nice little waffle station. <laughs> Rowan, Rowan, Rowan. And we got a nice selection of food down here. All the boys are getting ready, so. Big game tomorrow, business trip. You know, I gotta keep this thing going. I'm here with Marquise Bowden. Marquise, you had a big game today, seven points, nine boards. I personally thought you had 10, four big blocks. Uh, talk to us about that today. Uh, I mean, it's a tough road game, you know what I'm saying? Pittsburgh, tough environment, so we just had to come in with a lot of energy and get the win. Good stuff. You know, you was really doing a good job, you know, defending ball screens, move your feet. Talk about that. Uh, I mean, we've been practicing all week at it, you know what I'm saying? We know that they had a lot of tough guards that try to penetrate the rim, so I mean, I just tried to protect it best as I could. You heard it here first. Duke Nation, we out. Thank you.